what's up aquarius welcome to your monthly reading family i hope all of you guys are doing awesome my kings and my queens if you're returning or if you're new to my channel you guys don't forget to like and subscribe hit that notification bell um yeah i love you guys family for all of you who've been supporting me that's been down with me you my a1 day ones I appreciate everything that you guys have done for me. I would not be who I am today if it wasn't for you, okay? Y'all, this could resonate with your sun, moon, rising, or your Venus sign. Um, and this could take place past, present, or future. It depends on where you are at regarding your timeline. But let's go ahead and jump into y'all reading and see what spirit is wanting for y'all to know, Aquarius, for the month of April, okay? Freedom! Freedom! Okay, yeah, y'all gonna be free from something or you're searching for your freedom right now. You're trying to gain um, some type of momentum here. I'm picking up like coming out of a un like a stuck place. You're about to be unstuck. <laughs> okay, if I can get it out. We got honesty. Okay, so there's a lot of truth that's going to be coming in. Show me what I need to see in acceptance. I love it. I love it, family. This is giving me that energy of what will be, will be. Okay, case of rah, so rah. Um, letting go, letting go of control or trying to control a situation. It says, I possess the power and the free will to create my own happiness. So, family, if there's been something that's really been keeping you in the dark, stuck, feeling like I'm hearing restricted, you're breaking free here in the month of April. And I do feel like you guys are getting very honest with yourself, okay, about certain things here. I can't always expect the truth from others, but I can expect it from myself. So there could be certain things that you're looking at within you that you're realizing that was holding you back in the past. You're being very... I'm hearing cutthroat. So some of you guys, I feel like you're not going to be holding back. I'm hearing no filter. You're going to be speaking your truth, not only to others, but to yourself. A lot of clarity here is what I'm hearing. A lot of clarity. Acceptance. I am learning to accept the things that I cannot change. So for some of you, you're realizing that... There's been situations you've been dealing with that you can't change or you don't have control over. You're accepting the outcome or you're accepting whatever it is that happened, okay? It's out of your control. This is definitely what's going to be bringing in a lot of freedom. And it's also going to be bringing in your happiness. Some of you guys, um, I'm kind of getting the energy of operating in your upper chakras, Okay, you could operate more in your upper chakras than you do your lower chakras. But there's a balance that's needing to take place. Because this is giving me like the heart chakra, the throat chakra, um, third eye and crown. Okay, something about your upper chakras here. But I'm seeing balance. There's a balance that's coming in or balance is being restored. You're accepting your fate. That's what I'm hearing. Accepting my fate. No longer worrying or stressing about this. Um, this is you also receiving clarity from spirit though. You, you're receiving a lot of clarity from spirit. And it's like you don't have nothing to worry about. This was meant to play out like this. But it's like as soon as you let go and break free, that's where your happiness is coming in. You're releasing control here. Yeah. Let's see. Spirit, show me what I need to see. Let me move this over. Show me what I need to see for the Aquarius, the month of April. Temperance. Okay. I'm here and restore. We got the Nine of Swords. Why is this here? We got the Seven of Pentacles. 
So, family, I am seeing a balance come in here where you could have felt very unbalanced here in the past, feeling very overwhelmed, like you didn't have no say-so, no control. You could have felt like there was blockages in your way. For some of you guys, you could have been blocking yourself with your thoughts. Okay, I'm kind of getting like scattered thoughts or your thoughts could have been all over the place. Okay, seven of pentacles, something wasn't working or you had to you had to give up control here. I feel like mentally something was driving you crazy. And you realized that it was no point to continue to be in this energy or mentally you realized that it was causing stagnation. Let's see, Spirit, why is Temperance here? Aquarius? Temperance for Aquarius. We got the Two of Swords and the King of Wands coming out. Temperance. Three of Cups. Why is the Seven? Oh, let's see. High Priestess. So, something here was causing a lot of mental blockages, okay? It's something that you didn't see clearly. I feel like you guys are about to see something, though, or something that's going to be exposed to you. Like I said, for some of you, you could have put yourself in a mental imposed prison, okay? Really overthinking or overstressing about something. I am hearing truth revealed though, okay? Because we got the King of Wands and the Three of Cups. Somebody might not have known the truth about what was going on. If this is regarding a relationship or a partner you was dealing with, there could have been somebody that was lying about a third party here. I feel like Whoever this person is, they know that they are at risk of losing their family or losing something here by dealing with other people or like being deceptive. Because we got the high priestess. So, yeah, I'm hearing something is no longer working or somebody is not trying to mean something that they know need to be released. With the high priestess coming out, I'm hearing truth. Somebody know the truth about a third party. That's a side note for somebody very specific. And it could be an Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. But yeah, I'm hearing blocked. This person could have decided to block a third party here. Okay, their lies was getting caught up with them. For others of you, I'm seeing like you taking back your power. That's what I'm hearing here. You could be in this King of Wands energy, woman or man, take it how it resonates. But you seeing what was blocking you, okay? You're finally bringing your life into balance here or you're choosing not to focus on this. I am seeing your energy increase, your stamina, your strength. You guys, you could be, um, there could be somebody who's wanting to come in and collaborate with you or help you. I'm kind of getting the energy of receiving help. And I feel like whoever this is or whoever they are, these are people who are emotionally invested in your well-being, your outcome. Okay, with the high priestess, you can have a good feeling about certain people that's wanting to come in and talk to you. Okay, this could be friends here, or you could be receiving some type of divine information from a friend. But I, I'm seeing you set yourself free here. Spirit, show me what I need to see. Show me what I need to see for the Aquarius. Why is honesty here? For the Aquarius Honesty, April. Ooh, we got the page of ones coming in in reverse. 
Show me what I need to see. The Four of Swords coming in in reverse. Queen of Wands coming in in reverse. Some truth is going to be exposed here. And I do feel like it's about a third party. Okay, with the Queen of Wands. We got the King of Wands over here. But Page of Wands in reverse. Somebody made a bad decision. Um, I do feel like whoever this is, they're going to get caught up or they're not sleeping about this. They're not sleeping. They're not really resting because they know they got to be honest or they're going to have to tell the truth. There could be a queen of one, somebody who's very jealous or deceptive that's trying to come in and interfere with someone's life. Okay. This could have been a side piece or somebody this person was dealing with. Uh, but I'm getting threats. Somebody could be threatening, threatening, okay, this king of wands here, that they're going to come in and tell their family or their wife that they've been sleeping around with them or they've been dealing with them, trying to cause problems. And I feel like this person is going to have to be honest here, okay? For some of you guys, I feel like you could have been going through some type of blockages, when it comes to getting your energy up or changing your focus. I'm seeing major blockages here. A lot of stress, sleepless nights, over wearing, okay, feeling very drained. Yeah, I'm I'm definitely seeing you. Um, you're about to face this or you're about to see what's been blocking you. I'm hearing pessimistic. Some of you guys could have battled this, feeling like things was going to go wrong when everything was going in your favor, or this is like not having faith, belief, hope, like, yeah, I'm hearing drowning. Some of you guys felt like you was drowning here in your emotions, or just feeling very stuck in your head about a situation. Let's see. Some of you, this could be regarding your children. You could have been worried or focused about your children, okay? Especially if something is going on here in the family or in the home. Spirit, why is the page of ones here in a reverse? Aquarius. Aquarius, April. We got the nine of ones coming in in a reverse. Somebody was being sneaky, 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 okay? Nine of Swords, some lies, some truth, some cover up. All of this is about to be exposed, okay? Somebody could be at risk of losing it all unless they come out and be honest here. We got the Ace of Wands. Ooh. Somebody done got caught in a lie, okay? Um, there could be a wife. There could be a husband, some spouse, or somebody you was in a relationship. Um, the truth is about to come out about what this person been doing behind closed doors or what's been hidden from you. Some of you, you've been picking up on this intuitively about this person. Somebody is worried, too, that... They they should have never dealt with this Queen of Wands. This Queen of Wands is making this person life miserable because I feel like they're trying to get away from this person, but this Queen of Wands is still clinging on to them. This is somebody who's very jealous, very possessive. They feel like this person should be theirs. Um, yeah, they want whoever this is. They want them to accept their offer. Okay, and I feel like this person is being honest with this queen of wands. Like, I don't want you. It was just a one night thing or, you know, that time has passed. I'm happy where I'm at or I'm going to make things work with my family. Somebody could even be choosing to be alone. But they don't want to be with this queen of wands. This is somebody who a little loco. Okay, you got to watch this type of person. This is the type of person that will key up your car. All right, I'll put sugar and water in your tank. <laughs> Real tall. They screws ain't that tight. 
yeah Yeah, with the nine of wands in the reverse, this is talking about making a bad move or a bad decision. Some of you guys, you've been having sleepless nights here about this. I'm hearing, don't drive yourself crazy, okay? It's, for some of you guys, you've been driving yourself crazy here. And this could be over anything. I don't really see a lot of pinnacles out here. I don't feel like it's about money. It could be, but I don't see a lot of pinnacles out here. This could be somebody you was invested in, somebody you love, cared about, okay? There, there is some type of deception here or something that's been causing you to have sleepless nights. But I do feel like this is going to change for you, okay? Why is acceptance here? Why is acceptance here? Mm. Come on now. So we got the three of swords and the nine of cups. So you guys, I do feel like you're walking out of a painful period, okay? You could have felt backstabbed or hurt by a few people. I'm hearing, yeah, I'm hearing heartbroken. But I feel like you're about to heal, though. You're accepting something for what it is. And for some of you guys, you're going to be walking away. I am seeing you guys working on balancing out your emotion, your thoughts. Definitely a lot of healing here. And I am picking up like spirit is trying to come in and fill up your cup or like help you out. Okay, because this has been a hard, rough journey you done been on. You don't had to endure a lot. You had to face a lot. But there's healing that's going to be coming in for you in the month of April. Okay? But I do feel like some type of deception is going to be exposed. Some type of deception is going to be uh, revealed. Six swords. All right, family. You're going to be walking away and calling judgment here. Okay? Or there's some type of judgment that's going to be coming in as soon as you walk away. Spirit, why is the Three of Swords here in the Nine of Cups? Three of Swords in the Nine of Cups, Aquarius, April. Three of Swords in the Nine of Cups. It's hard, but you got to do it, okay? It's going to be hard. Whatever this is, family, with the Three of Swords, this is going to be hard or this is tough, okay? This is a battle, a lot of stress. Some of you guys, you're carrying a lot of burdens on your back. For some of you guys, whatever you find out could end up being very, it could end up being very painful, okay? I feel like you're going to be seeking new uh, options or new opportunities or exploring new opportunities here. Somebody was causing delays in your life too. And you guys are realizing it's time to move on from this person. Why is the Nine of Cups? Okay, we got the King of Cups coming out, Aquarius. We got the Four of Pentacles. Watch Judgment here. And we got Death. Okay, this is a heavy judgment call. Um... Okay, y'all, because I'm picking up marriage very heavy, okay? Um, somebody is going to be choosing to move, uh, move away from a third party here and focus on their family. It's like, you know, even though it could be diff difficult for this wife, this husband, our children here, this person is definitely moving out of um, stagnation or chaos. This is somebody who was dealing with a third party or somebody they weren't supposed to deal with. I do feel like this person is realizing where their heart lied and they're choosing to let go, okay? There's an ending that's taking place. And I feel like this person is not 
this is somebody who's not changing their mind here but there's a person that want this person to change their mind okay we got heavy scorpio here at the end so this is some type of this is a major judgment call a major ending that's taking place let's see For some of you guys, I am seeing where you've been like putting in a lot of work when it comes to a job. This could also be a business that you started. Um, it's been stressing you out or it hasn't been going your way. You can have a lot of responsibility on your backs and you've been really stressing out about this. Okay. Um, a lot of pain. For some of you guys, you've been shedding tears here. Because you could be trying to support your family, your children, your home, yourself. Just trying to take care of everything. But I'm, he I'm hearing brighter days are coming towards you. Okay? And I feel like it's because you're healing here. Something regarding your heart chakra was causing the blockage. Let's see. Spirit, show me what I need to see for the Aquarius. We got headphones. Cutting out distractions, okay? The need to listen, tune out the world, music help you heal. So some of you, you could be listening to high vibrational music or frequencies. But Spirit is saying it's time to cut out the distractions. Okay? I feel like you guys are doing this. Are you about to do this? Okay? Because good luck and good fortune is coming in towards you. But there was something that was causing obstacles here. But I'm hearing no more. And if there was something that's, that was going on regarding the relationship, I am seeing some type of healing take place. But this is you guys also changing your mindset. This talks about prosperity consciousness. So this is thinking more positive than negative. For some of you guys, this is what was holding you back. Like trying to change the outcome or trying to rush something here. We got ballerina. Yeah, I'm dancing. Some of you guys could be dancing here. Okay, or like I said, getting up your energy, doing something that's fun. Something, um, something that's going to make you um, more energetic. Get your power back. I'm, I'm also getting the energy of you guys becoming more disciplined here. There's something that you're needing to put your focus on. And this could be you having to look at this at a different perspective. I'm hearing the old way of doing this gotta die. Okay, so something that was causing you a lot of pain okay that you was doing like i said this could be regarding work or a business it's going to require for you to look at it differently or change something around because the old way of doing this is not the right way or it's not getting you very far this card also says practice make perfect so I am seeing you guys change things around. You could be coming up with a new structure, routine, a new system. But I feel like you're going to be dedicated to this. A ballerina don't become a ballerina overnight. It takes practice, endurance, strength, dedication. So something you're needing to dedicate your energy to and be honest about, okay? Maybe you wasn't giving it your all in the past. I feel like you're about to, though. Okay? Yeah, you're looking at yourself in the mirror. Okay, some of you guys was needing to do shadow work, but you're seeing clearly when it comes to your soul, what you need to do. This is a lot of self-reflection. Okay, especially in those areas you feel like you failed in or you felt like was going the wrong way. You're seeing clearly now about what you need to do. Being honest with yourself. We got knife. Okay. It, there is some type of betrayal. 
for some of you guys, you still been attached to a person's energy that betrayed you before. Okay, or this person betrayed you recently. Something about being attached to this person energy. You could have had a hard time letting go. But I feel like spirit is showing you that you need to cut a cord or you need to energetically detach yourself from this person. Okay, because I feel like this is somebody who was bringing you down. Okay, whether they was with you or not, they was energetically bringing you down. This could have been somebody who started a lot of arguments or fights. Somebody who disguised them, they disguise themselves when it comes to the public eye. This person is a completely different person behind closed doors. Okay, some of you guys could be facing court or going to court with this person. Okay, this is weighing pros and cons, desire for balance, a need for stability. Some of you guys, if you are facing some type of divorce here, um, I feel like spirit is going to be cutting somebody out of your life. Okay, that's really been causing a lot of pain. We got three people. It could be up to three people that's been interfering with your energy. It says third party love triangle outside interference, external factors. So, yeah, somebody was letting a third party distract them from their family or what it is that they need to do or should do. This person is finally breaking free. Show me what I need to see, Aquarius. We got soda coming in in reverse. So somebody could have went to a third party for more excitement, okay? Or to shake things up to see if they still got it. Um, but I'm kind of getting the energy of this blowing up in their face. You know how you shake up a soda and you open it and it pop? So something blew up in someone's face here, okay? And I feel like this third party really been trying to impress this person or come back into this person's life. This is somebody who sexually lure their victims in, okay, when it comes to sex. But I feel like this person is no longer falling for this. Or they realize that they need to walk away for good, okay? I am getting the energy of a third party playing games here. All right, or playing on somebody's phone or something. Spirit, show me what I need to see for the Aquarius. All these messages might not resonate with you. Only take what resonate, okay? We got the swords coming out. So, this is cutting out injustice, conflict, and aggression. There's a breakthrough that's about to come through. I do feel like you guys are being guarded at this time, protected by spirits. But I'm, I'm hearing it's two sides to a story. There's two sides to a story here. For some of you guys, there could end up being a dispute or confrontation, debate, something like that. Yeah, that's what I'm hearing. Oh, hold, hold on, wait. Tears, family, look at mirror. Like I said, y'all, y'all done went through a lot. And I feel like this is something you was needing to do because like I said, it was obstacle stagnation in your way. Some of you guys, it was because of your emotions or mentally you was going through it. But spirit has called you guys to do the shadow work, to face your fears, to let go of the pain, to see the truth behind what was going on here. Yeah, I'm hearing to pull off the mask, baby. And before I can even get asked out, I flipped over and saw this. So, yeah, family, I feel like y'all healing from somebody who was very deceptive here. And for some of you guys, you've been pushing down your emotions or refusing to look at it. Spirit wants you to address this. Get it out of your system here. Okay? Um, I do feel like somebody is going to be revealed. Okay? The mask is coming off somebody who betrayed you. Spirit, show me what I need to see for the Aquarius. Ooh. Oh, we got steering, wanting control in the driver's seat, road trip, and changing direction. This actually kind of flipped in in a reverse. 
okay? This could be in a reverse. Uh, give me another card for this. Somebody is losing control in their life, okay? And I feel like this could be somebody you was connected to. What? We got Apple. Somebody is losing control here. I'm hearing final warning. I am hearing this person is easily tempted. Okay. Or they realize that something got to end here regarding them being tempted or temptation or dealing with third parties. They realize that they are losing control over their life. Okay. Because somebody done found out about a betrayal. But there is an ending that's definitely coming in here. Yeah, I'm hearing some. This was meant to happen. Okay, somebody done went through a major test, but it was meant to happen this way. Somebody is also needing to pay attention to their health, okay? Because I'm kind of getting the energy of high blood pressure or sugar or something like that. Um, I'm hearing blurred visions. So, um, family, if that's you, Spirit wants you to pay attention to your health, okay? Try to eat healthy. Because I'm not liking the steering wheel in a reverse. Some, somebody health is affecting them at this time. But this could be somebody that betrayed you as well. If this person ain't careful, it could be an ending that's going to end up taking place. And look, y'all. Skull came out on top of death. Okay. Yeah, somebody got to be careful over here. Playing with God's children. Um, let's see. Spirit, show me what I need to see for the Aquarius for April. What else do my Aquarius need to know? Truth and clarity, Aquarius. Okay, we got Sagittarius coming in, family. We got cancer coming in. <laughs> Man, we got Leo coming in. Oh, we got a lot of zodiacs here. We already got up to three people. Somebody could have been dealing with multiple people. <laughs> multiple people. Do you hear me? Multiple. I'm also getting the energy, family, that you're going to be really... Um, working on yourself here okay exploring your fun side or even coming out of your shell being more sociable some of you guys you're independent at this time you could be a single mom or a single dad or you live on your own right now okay i feel like you're going to be coming out of your shell or coming out more this is like a thirst for life for balance um some of you guys, you could have been dealing with a Sagittarius here. But there's a major change that's going to be taking place. If you bite your tongue, you ain't going to be biting your tongue in April. All right? Um, I'm also seeing balance when it comes to your emotions, your home, your family. This is you guys balancing yourself, okay? Tapping into your intuition, but you are resilient, okay? And I feel like somebody don't like this about you. You are getting your energy back, okay? You're getting your energy back. You're learning to be loyal to yourself and go after your own ambitions here. I am seeing consistency. Some of you guys could have had an issue with being consistent with your work. Okay, especially if you're juggling the home life, family, kids, or, you know, you just got a lot of other things going on. Um, there's going to be a need for you to be consistent here. And I'm also hearing express yourself. All right. Not that fake. Hi, my name is. No, express yourself. Okay. Say, how, say what you feel and mean what you say. All of that. Okay, don't let nobody hold you back. There's a need for you to get it out. I'm hearing get it out. Some of you, like I said, you've been keeping things so bottled inside of you. 
and you're needing to get it out. And this could be um, through exercise, but this could also be your voice. Sing, do something to express yourself and get it out. This is going to help you out a lot. Okay, it's going to help you get your energy back up. All right, we also got healer. So yeah, you're about to heal here. Some of you guys could be doing some energetic work, okay? Or you could be going to see a Reiki practitioner. Okay, but yeah, I feel like you are going to be doing a lot of healing in April. You could be a nurse, a doctor, okay? But spirit is coming through to um, bring healing into your life and into your lineage. Spirit, show me what I need to see. Baby, baby, look, look, you coming out of a karmic storm, okay? Some debt done been paid. The energy is about to get a lot lighter, a lot of relief. You cutting ties with old people. Like I said, some of you guys, you was energetically still attached to a deadbeat, somebody who betrayed you or somebody who's in a very dark space right now, okay? You're breaking free. I'm hearing no more crying, no more tears, no more sadness or setbacks. Not for the month of April. <laughs> Not for the month of April. Spirit, show me what I need to see, Aquarius. The sun will come out tomorrow. <laughs> Leo energy coming out again. Look, secrets. Secrets is going to be revealed here. There could be some secret that's going to be revealed about a Cancer or a Leo. But the truth is coming out. The sun is shining. We got Jupiter coming in in a reverse. Somebody is going to have a stroke of bad luck, okay, with some type of secret that's coming out. Because, yeah, it's like spirit is shining light on some type of deception here. Mm, somebody's going to be stressed out about this. I don't feel like this is you guys for my good Aquarius, okay? It could be for my bad Aquarius or my, my Aquarius that's been out here uh, playing games. But I feel like this is somebody who betrayed you or did you wrong. They're going to suffer for this. Spirit, show me what I need to see for Aquarius. We got the Vine Masculine, okay? Flipping out all type of crazy we got healer here. So I feel like this some, something is going to happen to this person. And it's like spirit is trying to um, wake this person up or show this person something before it is too late. It's what I'm hearing. This is somebody who definitely needs healing at this time. But this person is struggling going back and forth between their good side and their bad side. Okay, being on the right side of the law and the left side of the law. Okay, yeah. Some of you could have been dealing with a narcissist. Somebody who's very controlling, rude, dominating. Or they try to control the situation here. Um, You're, you're going to heal yourself from this person. Let's get in here, spirit. Heart. Like I said, this person was causing blockages in your heart. Your heart is the center of your aura. That's where your electromagnetic field begin at. Okay. If, if, if your heart ever stopped, they have to shock your heart in order to bring you back. So something about this person, what they did to you, you've been holding on to this in your heart. Spirit is wanting for your heart to be as light as a feather. You're not needing to worry. You're needing to trust here. I'm hearing trust. But there's emotional balance that's about to come into your life. And you guys, you will receive a lot of awareness, okay, and clarity. But you're going through a major transformation. Your energy is starting to flow again, okay? Because I, like I said, some of you guys, you've been operating purely in your upper chakras. And you need to operate in all of your chakras, okay? Divine feminine, okay, with the king, the queen of wands sticking out at the back. Yeah, you need to operate in all of your chakras. Spirit, show me what I need to see. We got Gemini in third eye. 
somebody's been living a double life. And look, we got Sagittarius again at the bottom of the deck. Somebody's been living a double life here. And there's a person that's connected to this person that know about it. Okay? But I'm hearing no more confusion. Okay? Some of you guys, you're going to be coming out of this karmic storm in Gemini season. Okay? You could also be meeting the Gemini with hard Gemini and third eye here. There could be somebody new that's going to be coming into your life very soon. And that's why spirit is wanting for you to clear out this energy so you can receive this new love that's going to come in for you because this new love is the real thing. Okay? It's the real thing, baby. Let's see. Spirit, show me what I need to see for the people that will be watching this, my Aquarius, on YouTube. What do they need to know? We got construction, bill, and blueprint. Somebody could be a construction worker or have their own business. Some of you guys, I feel like you are rebuilding your life from the ground up or you're getting a solid blueprint on how to navigate through your life, okay? This could also be regarding your career. Um, some of you could end up going on an alkaline diet or working with herbs, remedies here. Or there's a lot of healing that's going to be coming in towards you. I feel like you're going to be honest with yourself about certain eating habits you're needing to let go of. Especially if you're a, you are an emotional eater, is what I'm hearing. Others, somebody could end up getting a house bill too. That's what I just heard. An ex is coming in to speak with you, okay? Um, somebody is wanting to come back into your life after they did you wrong. We also got check your email, okay? So family, you could be checking your email or there could be messages that's going to be coming into your email here. I just heard one way or another. I'm going to find you. I'm going to get you, get you, get you, get you one way. <laughs> okay, so if, side note, family. There could be a third party that's so focused on ruining this person's life that they can end up reaching out to you through your email just to expose this divine masculine here. So that's just a side note. Okay. Spirit, show me what I need to see. Why is Athelon diet here? Okay, we got the full moon, the blue moon, August the 30th. So, there could be something very significant about August the 30th, family. I'm, I'm hearing change in outcome. Okay, something is going to come through here between now and August the 30th. Show me what I need to see, Aquarius. Oh, we got dreams of snakes. <laughs> Y'all, there's an ex that's going to be coming back in to speak to you. And you're going to be dreaming of snakes before this person even walk back in your life. Okay? Or come in to talk to you. Spirit going to give you the 411 before this person even come in. <laughs> Spirit, show me what I need to see for the Aquarius. Okay, we got resort, Airbnb, and cabins. Some of you guys are going to be getting away. Okay, or making reservations here. There could be, um, some of you guys could end up meeting a construction worker or something. Um, but I'm definitely seeing like mail or messages. Somebody is going to want to take you out. Okay. Uh -oh. Somebody going to be wanting to take you out or something. Some of you guys are going to be starting your own podcast, radio, or you can start your own content or something. But I'm seeing a major change here when it comes to your business or how you live your life. I feel like you're going to be enjoying your life, okay? You're going to be enjoying yourself, spirit. Customers coming in by the bus load. Something is changing regarding the business. Like I said... <clears throat> in April, this could be up and running, like full bloom. Something about when you change your diet, your energy, all your abundance is going to come in. I just saw four, 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 four on the clock. Spirit, show me what I need to see, Aquarius. I'm going to have to hurry up and end it. Um, children are watching and listening. So 
I feel like your children could be concerned about it here, okay? Uh, they could even be dreaming of snakes. Um, but yeah, something about your children not liking this person or not wanting this person around you or something. Or they don't want this person to come back in the home. Home life, like I said. Yeah. Something regarding your home life is going to be changing. Okay, somebody definitely could have tried to lie on you or take your voice. They wasn't being truthful. Okay, yeah, we got Vicks and Fox. So, yeah, baby, you being very clever at this time. Like I said, for a lot of you guys, you standing on your own ten toes here. You standing on your own ten toes here. You are a vixen. You're very attractive. It's going to be some people very attracted to you. Not only like in a romantic way, but these are customers, clients, people that want to work with you. Um, but I, I'm seeing a positive outcome here. Baby, you're about to go through a radical rebirth. That's what that is. Okay? Spirit wants you to watch your thoughts. Your thoughts are very powerful right now. Um, stay optimistic. And I do feel like family, as long as you put in this work, everything that you want is going to come to you. Okay? Y'all, I hate to kind of cut this short, but I got to go pick up these kids from school. I love y'all so much. And if you stay to the end, y'all, it only takes not even 1.1 seconds to hit the like button. Okay? So hit the like button. So show support. Subscribe and hit the notification bell. And until we talk again later, I love y'all so much. Peace.